and I live in Waldorf. Please return the proposed comprehensive plan back to the Planning Commission with instructions to employ the studies the previous commission ignored, including a fiscal impact study. The proposed plan will degrade the Madam Woman Creek, home to one of the most biodiverse ecosystems in Maryland and the most productive fish spawning and nursery area in the entire Chesapeake Bay. I got my description from the county brochure on the Madam Woman watershed. The brochure speaks of mitigating the impact of impervious surfaces, but this plan puts the Matta Woman watershed directly in a huge development district with impervious surfaces predicted to be like that, like those that affect the Anacostia River. Depending on voluntary mitigation would be like putting on a Band-Aid after a shark has bitten off your arm. Bryan's Road should be designated a village not an urban center, like the citizens wanted in the visioning workshops, and like 71% of the voters told the SGACC pollsters, the cross-county connector should not be in the plan to funnel growth to the western part of the county. The new road is a tax burden we cannot afford. There are already three parallel routes to go to Bryan's Road from the intersection of Milton Road and Billingsley Road. The people that live on Billingsley do not have a choice. Use the $1 million you earmark to chase away around the state and federal permit denials to focus on increasing the safety of Billingsley Road. Remove the cross-county connector from the plan. My road, Bensville Road, used to be Route 228. The new Route 228 is already a cross-county connector to the western part of the county. Its existence has made my road's problems worse. The number of subdivisions on Bensville Road increased, increasing the traffic. Bensville Road still has stretches without shoulders, wicked curves, people that drive way too fast, and full road closures when there is an accident. How will this be different for Billingsley if the cross-county connector is built? It is time to get familiar with the terms induced traffic and induced growth caused by new highways. The cross-county connector will increase traffic on Billingsley, just as it did on my road, as 228 did on my road. There are many citizens that share my opinion that the cross-county connector is not in our best interest. Tonight, I am presenting 827 petitions collected by volunteers of the Mad Woman Water Set Society. Though we love recycling, these petitions have not been recycled. This is their first presentation to Charles County. Thank you.